Hi, and welcome to PAC's video course, Power BI for Business Professionals. My name is Dan Buskirk, and I've been a business intelligence and data analytics consultant for over three decades. I'm a Microsoft Certified Solutions Expert in Data Management and Analytics, and I'm a Microsoft Certified Trainer. Let's take an overview of what the course entails. In Section 1, we'll talk about installing Power BI. Now, this is actually more important than it might seem at first, since Microsoft is introducing new features at a prodigious rate. If you want to keep up with the latest and greatest tools in Power BI, you'll have to be installing almost on a monthly basis. In Section 2, we'll talk about the fundamentals of creating a report with the Power BI desktop. In Section 3, we'll begin to delve into the details of what makes a good data model for Power BI. Just like there are tents and there are skyscrapers, there are flimsy data models, and there are solid data models. We want to build a solid data model to provide a good foundation for our analytics and our reporting. In Section 4, we'll begin to examine Power BI visualizations in detail, carefully controlling the formatting and the data for the maximum reporting impact. In Section 5, we'll take a look at the data analytics language DAX, which you can use to customize column data and also measures so that you can produce exactly the analytic information that your organization requires. In Section 6, we'll talk about creating custom visualizations using the statistical language R. This is an excellent route to customizing the Power BI environment to specifically get the visualizations you want. Now, these same techniques can also be used in the popular language Python. In Section 7, we'll talk about publishing your report to the Power BI service. It's not enough just to create a report and keep it on your local hard drive. You need to be able to share it with colleagues and associates. We'll talk about the details of how this is accomplished, and we'll talk about the details of making effective dashboards in the Power BI service environment. The prerequisites for this course are very minimal. If you have a basic understanding of relational data, in other words, data stored in rows and columns, and you have a basic comfort level with Microsoft Office Suite applications like Microsoft Excel, if you can open data in Microsoft Excel and create a chart, you have all of the skills necessary to begin to work with Power BI. Our course goals are fairly straightforward. We want to be able to implement the three fundamental skills for Power BI analytics. We need to be able to import data from real world data sources. We need to create a practical Power BI data model from this data that we've imported. And then we need to use the data model to create Power BI visualizations to communicate key facets of our data. Once we've done that, we then want to be able to export the Power BI reports into the Power BI service, and we want to be able to integrate visualizations from those reports into Power BI dashboards. And there you have it. Let's get started. 